Hello and welcome back to our outlaw character. Today we're going to be trying to get to 66, get a new ability, and hopefully get some more kills. As we're over 100 now, we've got to start making our way to 200, you know? So let's hope 66 is something a bit better. And yeah, let's just get into it. So as you can see, I'm actually going back to Hellfire again, just because I wanted to get a bit of fights in the video. And Hellfire is probably the place where I'm most likely to find them. I don't, and the grand is going to be kind of harsh. So I thought, why not? Let's just go back, do a couple things here, and then we'll go to the grand. So yeah, let's go. Okay, so let's buff up everything, and then we can just go out. There we go. Nicely done. Nice kill. Pretty good. He was just running most of the time though, which kind of sucked. He didn't fight back or anything. Dude, our flame tom does so much damage. It's crazy. What's nice is, uh, again, Hellfire is a honorable combat zone. I'm sorry, sir. You crossed me when you had low health. I am sorry, sir. But you know, you did just give me 76 gold or some shit. Which is pretty nice. Let's go check over the Alliance side. And down over towards Zethgore. See, I don't want to get attacked by the miners. Because I feel like the miners are going to kill me. But we could just go for it. Fuck it. Yeah. Oh, damn, we got some greens. Oh, we actually got some nice hands as well. Worth. I thought those uh, miners and stuff were going to do more damage to me, but they didn't do shit. So we good. Damn, three kills already today. That's pretty good. What is going on today? Honorable combat hellfire is dead. I'm not even seeing kills in chat. This is sad. Okay, I couldn't find anybody, so we're just going to head off to... Zanga first, we'll check if there's anybody in Zangamash, and then we'll go to Nagrand. So this might be more leveling, less PvP, but we'll see. Maybe we get lucky. Who knows, maybe we'll find some fights in Zangamash, but it's a lot less populated than Hellfire, but it seems that there's nobody in Hellfire at the moment, which sucks because it's honorable. That's usually what makes Hellfire fun. I'm still really sad that I can't even quest in Garadar now, because of that fucking wolf. Because there's so many good quests there. That now I, I just can't do, which is kind of harsh. The next piece zone. Okay, we'll we'll run down to Amberven real quick. If it's the next piece zone, there could be people there. Only problem is this isn't a honorable zone, so there is chances of two v ones. Ah, oh, there we go. There is somebody. Zaishin. He's gonna own himself in a second. There we go. 24k for killing him here. Nice. We might as well just do this quest real quick. It's one of the best escort quests. It actually runs rather than just walks around like a dumbass. So I'm still thinking about getting rid of overheating because it's kind of not doing that much damage anymore. I'm wondering if it would be worth getting Arcane Barrage and going Battle Mage. I feel like that would be a lot of fun, because our Heroic Strike hits quite a bit, so we'd have quite a bit of a chance. And Arcane Barrage hits like a fucking truck. I never upgraded. I got to 64 and I didn't upgrade. Fuck me. 
I could have been doing way more damage this whole time. I thought my Frostbolt was feeling weak. Okay, so let's make our way towards Nagrand. Because that's going to be where the good levels are. So 66, we're hoping for Seal of Vengeance. We're hoping for Lesser Healing Wave. Or we're hoping for something else. Voidwalker, let's say. Ooh, there is dead stuff. There is dead stuff. New fight. First of Nagrand. There we go. It's no fun when people don't fight back, man. Like, you might as well just fight back. So we're going to shove that talent point as our last talent point into improved sprint. That way we our sprint has got a shorter cooldown and we can use it to get out of roots, which is really, really good. What the hell? It looks like my storm strike went off, but it didn't actually work. That was weird. Oh, I see that level 70 everywhere. Fucking everywhere, Vikings. Literally, wherever I go on this character, he's fucking running in the background. Like, tr taunting me. Okay, so that's those quests done. Let's go hand in. We don't have a pot or anything this time, so it's gonna not give as much as usual, but we're fine. We're doing it without a pot, so we have more time to kill people, I guess. Literally nobody around this morning. Nobody here in the Grand, nobody in Hellfire, even though it's an honorable zone as well. Well met. Ah. It's a fucking Iron Man. Good. Oh. At least he's good though. Thank you very much. Uh what was it? Zaldry? Zaldre? Thank you very much, dude. Ah oh, shit. I just realized we have to fight those lake elementals again, and once again I'm a Fucking frost build, and a lot of our damage comes from frost bolt. Damn it! <laughs> At least next time, our build won't be frost. Knowing that now that I said that, it's probably gonna turn into some sort of weird, I don't know, something to do with frost. Probably turn into a fucking death knight, knowing my luck. So, what we're gonna do now is we're gonna just do like these three all in a row, come around here, do all of these, come down here, and then we'll go up. And that should get us all of the quests done. And whilst we're here, we can actually do the Thorn Grazers as well. And there we go, done with Cleft Hoofs. Now moving on to Muckridden Cores. So far this is going really smoothly, like everything dies relatively fast. Everything's relatively easy, so that's nice. Shame about no PvP though. Oh my MT spawned. <gasps> Every time, man. So now we need to make our way over this way towards the rocks. And I think we'll actually level from killing the rocks. You can see what our next ability is going to be. If it's going to be something good or something complete and utter trash. Probably trash. But who knows? So we're actually gonna level off this kill, so let's hope that we get something insane to get. Here we go, boys. Aspect of the Hawk. I hate you. I actually hate you. Fuck you! With the hunter shit, dude! Come on! Dude, having aim shot has got me aspect of the hawk and readiness. Again, like a nice big build up, you know, looks like we're gonna get something good. And then no. Just dicked. Beyond belief. I guess there's rerolls that can, you know, straighten this build out a bit. Oh well, we should get some upgrades. Oh yeah, we got upgrades for aspect of the hawk, nice. I guess I should put it on. You know, the ranged attack power is always nice to have. I think we'll go look for a couple more fights, maybe. Once we're done here. Just because I feel like three is kind of low. And I want more murdering. <gasps> Fuck! I might be dead. Oh. 
Thank fuck. I gotta say, the Imp has been really nice because he actually gives a lot of HP. Gives me like 400, 500 HP, which is really nice. That's like the difference in some fights. You know, don't don't sleep on the Imp. Oh yeah, we got one more talent point, which I guess we'll put into dual wield spec. As it gives hit and frost fire and nature damage, which is all of our damage. I guess we could call this the multi-hybrid. Because I'm using lightning, frost, and fire. Multi-hybrid. So by the looks of it, Forge Camp Mageddon is uh, the hotspot for today. So we can go there, which is good. Okay, let's go check up at the hotspot. Because that's also a good questing area. We'll try not to attack anybody who's too low. Like, we won't go on like any 61s or anything unless they go on me. Maybe like the lowest will go is 63. 61. No, we won't go on him. 63 though. So there's actually two twinks up at the hotspot, so I'm not going to go up there. Like, they're the same level as me, and one of them has like 11k HP. So I think we're going to go down south again, and then if we don't find anybody, we'll just end the video there. I mean, we got some good fights, and what did we get? Six? That's not bad. Song dagger. Oh shit, that's a nice dagger. Don't mind if I do. I mean, like when we were 63, 64, we were taking on that level, so you know, I feel like it's fine to do it the other way. Some people in the comments might disagree, but you know, that's the outlaw life. You take what kills you can, and I left people who were way lower, like 61, 62s. Damn, this place is usually like full of people. Like around here down south is usually full, but there's fucking no one. <laughs> That wasn't earlier either. It's a shame. Maybe in Zethgore? I hope. I mean, there is literally tons of corpses. Hey, there's dead stuff. That's a good sign. There, 62. We won't kill you. We'll kill the level 65 gnome, though. <laughs> Trinket. Oh no, it's a neck. Spell power. <laughs> Wait, and we got two of them. What? That guy was just trying to kite the fuck out of me. His frostbolt hit pretty damn hard, actually. How much did he hit me for when he actually hit me? Oh, he crit me for 1.2. Okay, that makes a bit more sense then. Ooh, Torrin. Hello there. I'll let him absorb it. What's up, buddy? Ready? Don't even fight back. I mean, thanks for the 83. Six demon bag. Wow, we got nothing off that guy, but I'll take the 83 gold. Dude, Hellfire is the place for PvP in Outland. I mean, I don't think I've really got many fights anywhere else. Like, we got, like, what? One or two in the ground. We've gained, I think, around 400 gold today from killing. Plus the stuff which I'm going to sell on the auction house and stuff like that, so... We'll let him finish his fight. Okay, now we go. 
So many runners today, man. So many. Like, there's loads of people that just don't want to fight, which kind of sucks. But you could at least fight back. Even if you're gonna lose, you might as well try. Like, even if I'm getting 2v1, I try most of the time. Because, you know, you might be able to get one of them and just yoink the loot before you die. If I wanted to be a massive dick, I could just actually run into this mine and just stay down at the bottom, and then when people come down to do the quest, I just kill them. <laughs> would be such a dick move, but it would be funny. 63, you're in my level range, man, I'm sorry. Seventy's gonna kill me now. To kill this friend. Were you about to get opened on by a seventy? I think so. Griffin Rider, we can do it together. <laughs> together. <laughs> no way. Come on, kill him. Yes. <laughs> That's fucking beautiful, man. And we survive. Oh my god, get so fucked. <laughs> well, now I can say that I have killed a level 70 as a level 66. Oh, that guy must be so fucking mad. I would be. Holy shit. Dude, Griffin Rider, MVP. Oh, the fact that we killed his friend, he went on me, and then we managed to kill him because of the Griffin Rider. I, I don't know if we'd actually have managed to kill him anyway, even without the Griffin Rider, because the Griffin went on me first, and then somehow I de-aggroed it onto him. So I'm wondering if we hadn't have got the Griffin Rider on us, would we have been able to kill him anyway? Because he didn't seem insanely strong. I'm pretty sure the only reason we survived that is because the uh, because of honorable uh, because of honorable combat we get healed up after we kill or after we finish a fight. Did we really just get opened on by another seventy? Like, come on, dude. Surely you've got better things to do than killing level 66s. Almost losing. If I had Divine Shield, we might have actually done it. Now we have our Arden up as uh, off cooldown, on cooldown as well. Kind of sucks. Did I not even have Flame Tongue on just then? I didn't. I probably would have killed him. Fuck me. I actually probably would have killed that guy. Okay, here's that smiley guy. Nice! Another one down. I don't think he was ready for that. I really need to go sell stuff. I've just been primmed for so long that I haven't been able to. I was actually looking away from my PC for that split second where he attacked me there as well, so... <laughs> Thank you. 
Oops. I actually didn't know if the door was over. Dude, what is it with me and killing people right inside towns? I actually didn't realize that the door was over. I, I was just... Tr I was tunnel visioned on killing. Um... Oops. So guys, you can see down here my, my blues. This is what I've gained today. I've gained like 400-ish, 500 gold. But yeah, I think it was a pretty successful day. Well guys, I hope you did enjoy this episode. We managed to kill a level 70 as a level 66, and we almost killed another one. If I'd have my flame tongue and my divine shield, I seriously think that we could have killed that guy easy. No problems. So I hope you guys did enjoy this episode. If you did, then hit that like button and subscribe if you want to see more. And I hope to see you guys in the next video.